Black holes are super mysterious things in space. They're so heavy that even light can't get out. That's why we can't see them. Scientists have found out some really cool stuff about them. Here are 10 awesome facts about black holes. One, gravity wells. Some perceive black holes as cosmic vacuums pulling in surrounding space. However, in reality, they function like any other celestial body, albeit with an immensely powerful gravitational pull. If the sun were replaced by a black hole of equal mass, Earth would not be swallowed up. It would maintain its orbit around the black hole, just as it does around the sun today. The appearance of black holes seemingly consuming matter from all directions is often misunderstood. Companion stars release some of their mass as stellar wind, and this material is then drawn into the gravitational grasp of the nearby black hole. Two, Einstein theorized. Einstein didn't discover the existence of black holes, though his theory of relativity does predict their formation. Instead, Carl Schwarzschild was the first to use Einstein's revolutionary equations and show that black holes could indeed form. He accomplished this the same year that Einstein released his theory of general relativity in 1915. From Schwarzschild's work came a term called the Schwarzschild radius, a measurement of how small you'd have to compress any object to create a black hole. Long before this, British polymath John Michel predicted the existence of dark stars so massive or so compressed that they could possess gravitational pulls so strong not even light could escape. Black holes didn't get their universal name until 1967. Three, gravitational spaghettification. Black holes have this incredible ability to literally stretch you into a long spaghetti-like strand. Appropriately, this phenomenon is called spaghettification. The way it works has to do with how gravity behaves over distance. Right now, your feet are closer to the center of Earth and are therefore more strongly attracted than your head. Under extreme gravity, say near a black hole, that difference in attraction will actually start working against you. As your feet begin to get stretched by gravity's pull, they will become increasingly more attracted as they inch closer to the center of the black hole. The closer they get, the faster they move. But the top half of your body is farther away, and so is not moving toward the center as fast. Four, black hole formation. The only difference between a black hole and our sun is that the center of a black hole is made of extremely dense material, which gives the black hole a strong gravitational field. It's that gravitational field that can trap everything, including light, which is why we can't see black holes. If our sun were squeezed to just 3.7 miles wide, all its mass would crush into a tiny space, becoming super dense and creating a black hole. But in reality, we only know of one way that can produce a black hole, the gravitational collapse of an extremely massive star that's 20 to 30 times more massive than our sun. Five, space distortion. In space, if you make a deep well, space bends more. Black holes make the deepest wells. They pull space around them. Imagine space like a rubber sheet with lines. When you put something on it, it sinks a bit. The heavier the thing, the deeper it sinks. This bending makes the lines curve. A black hole is like a super deep well. Nothing, not even light can escape it. Six, black holes spawn. It might sound crazy that black holes could spawn new universes, especially since we're not sure other universes exist. But the theory behind this is an active field of research today. A very simplified version of how this works is that our universe today, when you look at the numbers, has some extremely convenient conditions that came together to create life. If you tweak these conditions by even a minuscule amount, then we wouldn't be here. The singularity at the center of black holes breaks down our standard laws of physics and could, in theory, change these conditions and spawn a new, slightly altered universe. Seven, powerful phenomena. Black holes are really powerful energy makers. Here's how it happens. Imagine a swirling disk of stuff spinning around a black hole. The stuff closest to the black hole spins super fast because of its strong gravity. This makes it super hot, like billions of degrees hot. This extreme heat changes the stuff into energy, which we call black body radiation. Compared to nuclear fusion, which changes only a tiny bit of stuff into energy, the black hole's process changes a lot more, about 10%. That's way more efficient. 
Scientists think this energy could be used for cool things, like powering spaceships that travel using black holes. It's still an idea for the future, but it shows just how powerful black holes are. Eight, astounding discovery. Scientists believe there is be a supermassive black hole at the center of nearly every galaxy, including our own. These black holes actually anchor galaxies, holding them together in the space. The black hole at the center of the Milky Way, Sagittarius A, is more than four million times more massive than our sun. Although the black hole, which is almost 30,000 light years away, is pretty dormant at the moment, scientists believe that two million years ago, it erupted in an explosion that may have even been visible from Earth. Nine, time dilation. As you approach the event horizon of a black hole, the immense gravitational pull distorts space-time, causing time dilation. This phenomenon, predicted by Einstein's theory of general relativity, means that time appears to slow down for an observer near the black hole compared to someone farther away. This effect is akin to the twin paradox, where one twin travels at near-light speeds while the other stays on Earth, resulting in the traveling twin aging slower. Similarly, as you venture close to the event horizon, the gravitational force causes your velocity to increase dramatically, resulting in time passing slower from an external observer's perspective. This gravitational time dilation is one of the fascinating consequences of black hole physics. 10. Hawking radiation. Black holes might not be bottomless pits after all. Some energy might be able to escape them. This surprising discovery was first predicted by Stephen Hawking in 1974. The phenomenon is called Hawking radiation after the famous physicist. Hawking radiation disperses a black hole's mass into space and over time will actually do this until there is nothing left, essentially killing the black hole. This is why Hawking radiation is also known as black hole evaporation. In conclusion, black holes mesmerize with their mysteries, challenging scientists and enthusiasts alike. As exploration deepens, expect more mind-blowing discoveries unveiling the secrets of these cosmic wonders and the universe's fundamental laws. Subscribe for more mind-expanding content. Thank you for watching.